The nurse is the face of healthcare. A very important part of that role is to communicate effectively and properly with clients, significant others, and members of the healthcare team. These are personal qualities that cannot be acquired through a book or lecture. And really, the best way to attain these skills is through practice. ATI provides that practice tool with Nurses Touch, an exclusive online nurse development product line designed to help students sharpen the social and personal skills needed to face the emotional and physical demands that come with being a nurse. Within Nurses Touch, students have those opportunities to rehearse and develop those key soft skills through two unique simulators, the communicator and the leader. Let's start with the communicator. This interactive simulator lives within the professional communication content area package of Nurses Touch. This tool has two modes. First, the communication simulator mode gives students the opportunity to practice communication with clients, their significant others, and other members of the healthcare team. With employers' growing focus on patient-centered care, there is an equal demand for a higher level of communication skills from nurses, particularly related to the development of nurse-patient partnerships, the exact skills polished during practice with the communicator. The other mode of this simulator is the Technique Identifier Mode. This mode gives students the opportunity to identify therapeutic and non-therapeutic communication techniques. Within the Technique Identifier Mode, students learn beyond which behaviors are appropriate in situations. They learn technical reasons particular communications categorize as therapeutic or non-therapeutic behavior. These two engaging learning modes truly empower students to apply information learned in the curriculum and through other Nurses Touch products. It exposes them to interactive video cases that are invaluable to preparing them for the nursing world. A world where there's growing importance placed on the interpersonal and intrapersonal skills supporting the application of their psychomotor skills. Let's take a closer look at the communicator simulator mode. Five cases are available. Once a case is selected, the student is brought to an overview page that describes the case in greater detail and introduces students to the characters he or she will encounter. When the student is ready to begin, the Begin Case button can be pressed and the case video begins. Students have a progress bar to keep them oriented as they navigate through the case. Case videos are organized into stages or short sections. Once a stage ends, the student is taken to a character selection screen. A nurse's role is to not only communicate with the patient, but others as well. The character communication page appears at each stage break, allowing the student to communicate with all relevant characters. The student can select a character and communication options are available. Verbal and nonverbal options are available. When an option is submitted, feedback is immediate. Characters will respond through video with an appropriate response to the student's selected communication option. Also, correct and incorrect indicators appear next to each option. Students can now remediate by playing the character responses for all potential scenarios. Students can also view rationales to better understand why an option is therapeutically sound or not. The student communicates with the other characters in this same fashion. Once all the characters have been communicated with, the case continues, moving the student to the next stage. This video and communication pattern continues until all stages are covered and the case reaches a conclusion. Then a report generates, showing the student how he or she performed overall as well as within each stage. This performance breakdown presents another opportunity to sharpen areas in need of particular remediation. By the end of the case, the student has experienced the opportunity to communicate in many different ways and with many different people. The communication simulator mode mixes engaging video, simulated communication, and testing with instant remediation into one powerful and interactive learning experience. Now, let's take a closer look at the Technique Identifier. 
10 cases are available from which to choose. The user can get acclimated to the case and get started when ready. Unlike the communication simulation mode, this mode is not organized into stages. Instead, the student is presented with a complete case video that runs for several minutes. Once the video ends, the student has the opportunity to identify therapeutic techniques he or she witnessed during the case. Again, feedback is immediate. The student can view which selections are correct or incorrect, as well as rationales. Next, students have the opportunity to identify the non-therapeutic techniques witnessed. Students are provided with a report detailing their performance. Overall results are provided, as well as a breakdown by therapeutic and non-therapeutic techniques identified. Let's now take a look at the leader within the leadership and delegation content area package of Nurses Touch. It provides the venue to practice leadership skills. With growing and noted attention, employers continue to expect nurses to engage in multiple forms and levels of collaboration within their environment. With the leader, students will develop and remediate key soft skills needed to meet these expectations. Here's a deeper dive into how the leader works. There are five cases. Once a case is selected, the student is brought to an overview page that describes the video case in great detail. It also introduces the student to the characters he or she will encounter. The student begins by pressing the Begin Case button. Students have a progress bar to keep them oriented as they navigate through the case. Case videos are organized into stages or short sections. Once the student views the case videos, he or she answers key leadership and management questions. Correct and incorrect indicators appear next to each option presented. Rationales are included for remediation. A report generates, showing the student how he or she performed in each question, as well as overall performance. This breakdown presents yet another opportunity to focus on areas in need of remediation. Students must learn nursing soft skills. They include staying healthy, learning to manage work-related stress, conveying professional behaviors and attitudes, using nursing informatics and technology, as well as knowing how to function as a leader of the healthcare team and how to be a client advocate. We recognize that educators often don't have the time or educational materials to teach these soft skills, yet it's a distinguishing skill set needed for great nurses. This is why ATI developed Nurses Touch, the exclusive online nurse development product line designed to help students sharpen social and personal skills needed to face emotional and physical demands that come with being a nurse. To learn more about making Nurses Touch a part of your program, contact your healthcare education consultant or visit atinursestouch.com today.